Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. The world can be a very scary place. Villains can be larger than life. And almost impossible to defeat. The stress of saving the world can turn even the best of friends against each other. And not everyone will be on your side. Some will try to take advantage of your kindness. But a true hero will know exactly what to do. And will inspire others to do the same. But the scariest thing of all, even for the bravest hero, is discovering the villain is much closer than you think. Find the admin. Find my friends. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Excuse me, Mr. Disembodied Voice. Uh, who are you? The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in check zone. zone. Yeah, I heard you. He's just here to make sure all guests behave themselves. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, yes, Jesse. Welcome to the Sunshine Institute. It's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. So it's a prison. Hey, no, no, we don't use the P word here. But it is a prison. Let's not challenge authority. The admin doesn't let us use that word, so we don't use that word. Understand? Y you know he's not here right now, right? You never know. What about my friends? I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, 
Very unlucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. Yeah, you have zero idea what you're saying. Mind that attitude, Jesse. And if your friends are anything like you, they'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick. I have a another guest on my manifest. Female, hothead. Favorite weapon? Sword. Favorite tool? Sword. Favorite food? Sword? You gotta distract him. Petra, that's definitely Petra. Jesse! Oh man, I am so happy I found you. This freaking place. I know, let's get out of here. Wait, you can't, it's too dangerous. Stop them, associates! Feeling shouty? Shouty, punchy, butt kicky, freaking admin, he tricked us. He tricked me. Oh, it just makes me want to scream. Again. Well, I know one thing. I'm glad you're here with me. You're glad, and I'm mad. That's a combo I can work with. And the admin has Jack. It never ends with that guy. Looks like we're trapped. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse. Not sure how we're gonna get out of this one. We'll never make it through like this. Then we run! Where? Wherever they aren't. Stop them! Don't let them reach the burrows! Where we are. What is that? Whoa! Great, more weird monsters. Are those zombies? is endless! Petra? Petra! Jesse! Where'd you go? <laughs> gotcha! Oh, really wish I had that gauntlet right about now. Yeah, maybe not this way. Those things. A spider? Creeper? Hmm. Must be the admin creating his version of what a monster should look like. Of course, why would there be only one? There's never just one. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Yeah. <laughs>
minutes and already apprehended in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just... That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. And bring that one to my office. Close the door, would you? Do as you're told. Close it yourself. Fine. Be defiant. Oh, large Henry. <laughs> Defiant. <sighs> Disappointing. Looks like I'll have to keep an extra eye on you and your crew. My crew? Oh, let me show you. Radar! Nerm! You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself, and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well-behaved. Your friend, with the glasses, is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. If you know what's good for you, Warden, you'll let them go. Oh, I'm sorry, but threats? definitely fall under the category of not well-behaved. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy, glasses? Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. No, 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 no this place is filthy! Ah, oh, so disorganized! Ah. Making me crazy. Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay. I was so look, I was so worried. I'm glad I'm okay. I'm just relieved that you're okay. Oh, you were worried about me? Meet the Iron Breath Taker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. <gasps> Gulp! <laughs> now, I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? Work for me as an associate, and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Don't do it, Jesse! <laughs> What's it gonna be? Okay, I'll do it, just stop! Oh, that's so great to hear. <laughs> That was so dark. <sighs> easy, easy there. Radar, was it? You just had quite the harrowing experience. But don't worry. Our newest guard, er, associate, will be walking you out. Jesse, no. I don't know how much more of this I can take. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. I did this for you, Radar. I'm trying to protect you. What? No. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Stella? What are... How... Well, I... Uh, 
appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Ah, oh, you two know each other? <laughs> come on, you're still working that rival angle? Get some new material. Angle? <laughs> it's etched in stone, Jesse. Careful, Warden. Jesse may deny being my rival, but trouble is still trouble, and Jesse is definitely that. Now, come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I've barely arrived, and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe readjust your concerns. There are bigger silver fish to fry than... than... friends. If anyone here needs a friend, it's you, Warden. Ever since the admin sent me here, I... What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange, Jesse. Let's go, rival! That's right! Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom. Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Show him around, would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment to process. You have to watch your back with her. She's ruthless. Ta-ta, Jesse. I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. <sighs> you okay, Radar? Wish I was. I need something to eat. Get my strength back. You're in the right place. Guests make mushrooms too here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. There's one! Mushroom! I'm gonna starve. Waste away. Oof. No more radar. Just grab some mushrooms and you can feed yourself. No can't do, boss. I'd be finished for sure if I start scrapping with those brutes. You're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion! Hey there, guard friend. You just caught me putting a happy little finishing touches on my happy little painting here. What, uh, what you painting? I'd so love to paint a happy little mushroom, but none ever stick around long enough for me to paint. 
I know that you guards don't usually help little old me, but could you build me a happy little mushroom to paint? Here's some wonderful dirt for you to use. If it's not too much trouble after all. Despite being so close to finding a suitable champion, the spot remains open to all. Especially any wannabe adventurers whose names might rhyme with Nessie. Just throwing them out there. Good day! Now that is just... that is just lovely. Thank you ever... Ever so much. Please, okay, whatever, you must you share your thoughts is. on my work I so far. Don't you hold thing. back now. Honesty's the best policy. Oh my gosh, it's great. It's, the uh, chiaroscuro is just impeccable, Seriously. truly. So happy you like it. And now, I like you. You'll be spared when the bad thoughts come. Look, I have something important to ask. Go ahead. Any idea how to get some food around here? You want some food, huh? Well, associates talk to associates, so go ask Anthony. He'll know. I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. So fighting over a tiny handful of mushrooms is the only way they can eat? Mm, mm. Yep. You are all here. Mm. Oh, do guards get cookies? <sighs> okay, look. I thought you knew. The guards have a delicate supply of ingredients, none of which are approved by the warden. these cocoa beans. I don't have any wheat for you, but I can tell you who does. That pal of Goosen can set you up with the wheat. He's my source. Okay, I should be able to reason with the guy. <laughs> oh, no. He's absolutely unreasonable. You're gonna have to remind him that you're an associate and he's a guest. So, uh, I hear you might have some wheat? I need two of them. I don't know who you've been talking to, but it ain't true. Wheat is considered contraband in this facility, and I am nothing, if not a stickler for the rules. Cut the slime, guest. Hand over the wheat before I make things difficult for you. Oh wow, here for all of five minutes, and now you're gonna push me around. Ugh, you better remember this. I want special treatment from now on. Yeah, yeah. Hey, come here. Wheat and cocoa beans. All yours, Jesse. No way! I've been down here for too long. I can't stand another second! Whoa! Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hungry. Ah, give me that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just so hungry. Uh, <clears throat> hello? What's going on in here? Jesse! I expect far better from my associates than this. When cookie's not that big of a deal, when cookie's not that big of a deal. And just who does this contraband belong to, hmm? Whew. <laughs> you all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine Institute. So who does this belong to? You might as well just come out and tell me. It'll be so much easier for everyone. A guy attacked me with it! Hmm. What refreshing honesty. More like what a refreshing lie you mean, you rotten snitch! You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... No! Not the zombie mines! Not the zombie mines! Yes. Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. Well done, associate. You've successfully apprehended your first contraband. 
Keep up the good work. At least now I can make a cookie for Radar. Not much, but hopefully it'll help Radar get his strength back. Here, eat this. Get your strength back. Thanks, Jesse. I really appreciate... Uh, yeah, sure, thanks, whatever. Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean... This is prison! So from now on... I'm Prison Radar. I'm gonna get my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Break whatever rules I feel like! Hey, that's the spirit, Radar. You look awesome! Really? Thanks. Now, get out of here, guard. It's time for Prison Radar to show this world what he's made of. That's right. Come at me, dude. What's going Prisoner on? Prisoner X has escaped. I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped. All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. I think they mean cell? Yep, you should get in one too. You haven't had your Protocol X training yet. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Prisoner X? Yeah, apparently she's this infamous prisoner who they have to keep locked up super tight. Always escaping. They say she even knows her way through that maze. Apparently, she's locked up way deep in the prison. That sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Yeah, no kidding. We might be able to get out of here yet with someone like that. But where is she exactly? According to NERM's sources, Prisoner X is locked up in the deepest, darkest level of the Sunshine Institute. Cell Block X. Uh, detecting a theme with the names. Yeah, they're big on that X thing. We need to get to Cell Block X. Way I heard it! You can't just get into Cell Block X. But, it sounds like the zombie mines are right next door. If we can go down to the mines, maybe we can find this Zara person. Well, you're doing this whole associate thing, right? Maybe you can get the warden to, like, promote you. Might be worth a shot. Even if the warden is kind of a dork. Hmm, huh. the warden does seem to like me. Working the joy to our benefit. Prison Radar approves. Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up. I'm gonna find a way to get us to cell block X. Roger that, Jesse. But how to get promoted? That Oxblood guy sure looks suspicious. If I can catch him doing something against the rules, maybe I can get promoted. do with this. I think there's another room back there, but how do I get in? Secret buttons, nice! 
Now we're on to something. Okay, time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. Okay, looks like the buttons move the blocks. I did it! Yes! Oops. Now, if only someone had been around to see me being this impressive. A mooshroom? What the heck are you doing here? Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Yeah. Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor. How about you explain what you're doing? I'm questioning someone who's about to lose a lot of teeth if they don't mind their tune. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Did I hear mooing? Oh, come on! Excellent work, new associate. You see, this is how you get promoted. Work your way up. But first, to maintain order. This creature cannot be allowed to undo the balance of the mushroom. Share it, uh, would you, Jesse? But then it'll be... An ordinary cow, yes. You know, bringing back the balance of the mushroom. Thought that was obvious. What? No! Don't do it, Jesse. Not liking your hesitation here, Jesse. Fine, I'll do it. No. <laughs> I can't watch. wasn't so hard, now was it? As for you, Jesse, it's clear you are ready to advance to bigger and better things. You've been promoted to the lower levels, the zombie mines. I get to be your boss now, Jesse. Aren't you the luckiest associate of all? Now get a move on, we don't have all day. Zombie minds, Jesse. Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is... It's gross. I, I get it, but why? It's all part of the admin's plan. I, uh, you know, I think. To toughen people up. So if it makes the admin happy, then... Let's make him happy! I can't believe you're actually behind the admin in all this, that you actually believe in him. You're just jealous that I'm in good with him and you got tossed into prison. Who knows, maybe if you work hard enough, someday he'll give you a job, I don't know, cleaning up Luna's climate-controlled llama house. <sighs> Though I suppose, now that we're colleagues at all, I shouldn't leave you completely in the dark. Our job is to supervise the guests as they deal with the endless zombie hordes. Even you couldn't mess this up. Eh, 
Maybe I should knock on wood. Makes sense. We are guards, after all. That's the spirit. I may have the superior outfit, general demeanor, hairstyle, and sense of modesty, but yes, we are both still guards. This may not be my dream destination, but at least I'm better off than her. Her who? Prisoner X? You must have heard that alarm before. She was recaptured, but not before taking out a lot of guards. Don't get any ideas, though. Only the Warden's allowed to see her. Now, if you'll excuse me, Luna and I are off to prove why we're the best associates. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall? Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. Gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey! Don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. You know how certain things are your business? Yeah, this ain't one of them. Well then, someone is salty. Hmm, so that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. What happened? What are you guys doing down here? We couldn't leave you by your lonesome, so we cooked up some trouble and got ourselves sent down too. We're in this together, so we stick together. You guys rock. I'm so glad to see you. Almost as glad as we are to see you. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Jesse, no fraternizing with the guests. You know, we do know someone who came from the outside who might have all her inventory. Ugh, oh, Stella. Jesse, you can't keep socializing with your guest friends over there. It's bad form. Gross. Yeah, about that. I, uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. It's probably stupid. You'd never know when you need a lever. That's what I always say. A lever? In a prison reformatory? Really, Jesse? Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. He's just using you. How can you not see that? No, uh, it's, uh, mutual. We're, you know, using each other. I think. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Um, uh, you know, and power, and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. They will be just... Oh, yeah, who am I kidding? I have done so much for them in the past, I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look, maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. 
But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. Uh, sure, Stella, we'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Do this. Zombie wave incoming. Prepare yourself. Surprised. Admin? The warden told me you were zooming up the associate ladder. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? I don't know if you're dense or what, but working somewhere usually means you don't do things to actively destroy where you work. H hang on, Admin. I it's just a misunderstanding. L let's just talk this out. Misunderstandings? Oh, we are way past misunderstandings. Way past. <laughs> Admin! Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I I'm ju I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. No, no, not that. You're Star Guard Jesse is nothing but a saboteur. You were my greatest hope. You were moving up the ranks, and now you've ruined me. I thought you were following in my footsteps. Yeah, sorry about that, Warden, but you kind of work for a terrible person. He doesn't deserve an apology, Jesse. Oh, for the love of... Enough! How truly you disappoint me. for you, and you, and you, and especially you. And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty, to prove your worth as my champion. I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun.
I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. You gave it all away. Jack, what's going on? I'm... I'm sorry, Jesse. Are you afraid, Jesse? Get over it quick if you are. No, I can't. This isn't happening. Ow! Jack! Mouth shut, ears open. We only have one chance here. I'm gonna head over to the admin and we'll both attack him. Trust me, friend. You're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh oh. Oh! All I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore, and I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about? Prisoner X, what about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. So I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. That... that's so sad. Oh, spare me the petty party. I don't need it. <laughs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. Everyone loves Jesse, right? No. Oh, no way. You coming? Trust me, and take care of Luna for me. Coming, darling admin! Stella is just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry, I'll take good care of Beacon Town. <laughs> He's gone! Jesse, we gotta stop him! Jack! Look, I am sorry, everyone. I, I can't... I just... I'm sorry. Uh, shut up with the sorries, you doof. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. I'm glad you're okay, Jack. Hmm. Yeah, uh, it got a little dicey there for a while, didn't it? I mean, after what happened with you know, not Voss, then I was in the admin's freaky place and, and uh, not in control of what I was I was uh, doing. I was in pain. I I, I I was so scared that you'd all give up on me. Hey. That's... that sounds horrible. Jack, we would never give up on you. Yeah, hey. I appreciate that, but if you'd seen what I'd seen... Beacon Town was already worried about you, Jesse. Wondering where you were, wondering if you were okay. I'm sure the admin is heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. 
Admin will wish he had never even seen my face when I'm done with him. No one wears my face except for me. We made it! Whoa. some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. All we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Mm. Come on, I think we can make that jump. Oh. You're up next, Nerm. Mm. Oh. Okay, now you, Loon. Mm. Seriously, how do you do that? Last jump! Jesse, you must be Prisoner X. <sighs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! I'm not your enemy. You don't need to threaten me. Yes, but it's so much fun to threaten you. I don't get much fun these days. Look, Prisoner X... Zara! You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? Oh. No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. That's why they tossed you in here, right? This place is intense. I don't think they put you down here for crafting illegal flower pots. Yes, it is rather excessive. Isn't it? The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? He would want you to think that. Of course he would. That's funny. I call him Slimeball because that's what he is. And a jerk. He has that effect on people, it's true. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person, except to put the Warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more Warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help any me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. Oh, so glad you changed your mind. You changed my mind, Jesse. You're obviously a formidable ally. But don't forget, you do need me. I'm the only one who knows the way out. If you know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. 
If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. That's the only way out. Hey, you tricked us! You did this on purpose! Well, perhaps I did. But I couldn't be sure you'd agree to do this. Could I now? Oh, I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving! I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Hey. 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 Nurm, no, you can't do that. Hey. Oh, come on. We seriously don't have time for this. I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. without you. <laughs> Luna, stay right there, okay? <laughs> You're a good llama. You're a hero, Luna. How did you... My straitjacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. Prisoner X, I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. What's the matter, friend? <laughs> Nurm here says you wouldn't let him stay, and left Luna in his place instead. <laughs> Nurm, you can't blame yourself, pal. We'll come back for her, Nurm. Somehow. Hey. He says he'll take your word for it. For what it's worth, I'm glad you made him come with you. Thank you, Jesse. Uh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes! Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. And his front, and his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. Not my friend, not my problem. I'm moving on. Oh, all right. I never knew your heart had such icy tendencies, Jesse. <laughs> Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! Take the enchanted iron sword, or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the 
iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. Okay, definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Agreed. What? It's versatile. Actually, not a bad look. Looking good, gang. Now let's. You go. jerks better not have taken all the cool weapons before I got to dig through them. Friends reunited. It's a prison miracle. Even if Jeff is a little uh, completely different. I ought to pound you to pulp for what you've done to Jeffy Boo. Incoming face punch! Look. Big, red, and ugly. Maybe you should reconsider your emotions right now. Prisoner <laughs> explosions. I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here. Come along, Jeffy. That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? <laughs> the opening should be just around this corner. We have a situation here. Back! Back! All of you! One more step and it's Kaboomsville! Jesse! Hey! You're wearing a guard's outfit! Well, guards ain't in charge no more. And furthermore, I'm not a fan of guards. So thusly, you're getting beat up. A bunch. Oh, boy. Well, dip my bristles. Look who it is. It's my happy little friend who took a look at my happy little painting. Jesse, you freed Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! I think you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is Way worse than bad news! She doesn't deserve to be locked up. None of us do. Did you know she was once an admin, too? The admin had to take her powers away! She tried to destroy him! I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what! And I'll keep that promise. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it! <sighs> Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. So is it true what he said about you? You were an admin? Well, ugh, it's complicated. We want answers, Zara. Fine. Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me! So glare in another direction! I'm innocent! You're just another victim of the admin. Just like the rest of us. And there will be a lot more victims if he isn't stopped. Soon. Don't believe a word she says, Jesse. She'll say whatever she can to get in your good graces. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. I can go with her, Jesse. I don't trust her. Petra, you haven't seen what the admin is capable of. We need any help we can find. But really? Her? Jack's right. We need Zara's help. It's the only way. I just hope you're right. Don't forget that she used to be an admin, too. Romeo did 
always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Uh, run! Yep. Stay ahead of you. Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing! They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Let's be scarier. Just let me think! Sure it's just thinking? Ah! Oh, come on, she didn't get lost on purpose! No, I didn't. Thanks, Jesse. Wait, we can just build to the top of the wall... ...and get to the other side that way! Yeah! Sounds good to me. Where are you going? She ditched us!
Percy, you're amazing. <laughs> that was unbelievable. And you stuck the landing. Nice. Oh, that? It's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory. Well, there it is, guys. Our ticket out of here. That is sparkly. The sparkliest. Is that... diamond? <laughs> Where is everyone? That maniac is gonna get herself killed. Would that be such a bad thing? We should lend her a hand, shouldn't we? Maybe we should just go. But she sounds like she's in serious trouble. Jack, we need to think about ourselves too. We're not abandoning her. I told her I'd help her escape. It's time to prove it. We can't just leave her, come on. Ugh, I can't believe we're risking our lives for another admin. You came back. I said I'd get you out, didn't I? Now show us the way. I know you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. Let's go. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. I'm not much of a people person anymore. If I ever really was, it's gone now. We've all suffered because of the admin. And some have suffered much worse. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. Uh, where's the rest of it? Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the bedrock. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. I really do want to believe you. Then believe me. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. That's crazy talk, all those monsters. I don't care. She's an admin. An admin killed Voss, then stole his identity, and then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. <laughs> See? I told you. These stairs lead to our salvation. Now there's a good reason to get a move on.
can't let anyone run around disguised as me or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is, well, it's unthinkable. That's why I summoned you. Track them down. Make sure they're behaving themselves. <coughs> Man, oh jeez. Run, 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 Jesse. As fast as you can. 